so much build up to this moment right now. How do you guys feel, right? Like, you guys know these people. You know them through and through. What's my the... heart's out of my chest right now, <laughs> honestly. You don't understand the pressure. Like, there's been so much that went into this. So many different storylines. So much trash talk. We're going to find out right now. Oh Here we go. Austin McBroom in the orange trim. And orange fluffy trim. Yeah, Bryce Hall in the red and black. Austin smiling at him early. Immediately, I like this stance of McBroom a little better. Bryce Hall said he's been sparring four to five times a week. Good left hand by McBroom. And that's the best thing these guys can do, right? It's all about experience. The more sparring, the better. Now, Austin's been used to coaching with, with other sports and everything else. Bryce Hall. Oh! Uh -oh. Austin got in trouble. McBroom, a little shot there on Bryce Hall as they broke up. Bryce Hall's been in over 40 straight fights. Oh. Very interesting. So he does bring a little experience to the to this ring, right? And anytime there was an influencer meetup, Bryce Hall got in a fight with another influencer. It happened so many times, I, I couldn't even tell you. Awesome McBroom, a former NCAA basketball player, said his dream was to play in the NBA. explains why Austin's footwork is looking so nice right now. Paul immediately One trying point. to tie up. He got a point One taken point. Oh, for that. Pick him up, keep it clean, and then the fucking coin. Let's go. This ref is not All having right. the nonsense. His team needs to tell Bryce to stay composed at this time. So the referee just took a full point away from Bryce Hall. Well, it looked like he was going in there, and he's doing more of a full contact MMA type of style, right? That is not what we're doing here. Well, that's Bryce. I mean, that's talk about the street fights he wants to tackle people this ref could stop this fight i hope he doesn't i hope he doesn't i already see blood pouring out, out of bryce's nose. nose well and bryce looks scared right that's why he's tying up he's getting hit really hard and he's scared on his ears the fear in his eyes another big left hand if, if he doesn't lift his in the ref stop hey, hey guys there's a million dollar bet on the line here they wait, bet wait. each other one million dollars I'll be honest, I was so into that round, I didn't even look at the clock. No, I didn't, I didn't see it. Hey, bet on the knockout. The knockout. The knockout, the knockout. has to happen for the million dollar bet to go down. Hey, it's looking like, pretty good for McBroom at this point, right? All right, so a knockout or a TKO, does that pay too? I think he, it was Kim's interview, I believe it was in my, a knockout. It, okay. Knockout in my That's interview. Okay, so he has to be knocked out. Okay. But if you look around, you see how the entire arena has pushed up. I mean, this is insane. The craziest thing I saw when Bryce was in this corner, Austin's team was literally yelling at him from ringside, trying to get into his head, when trying to make him lose his Ooh. composure. Hey, it's strategy, baby. That's strategy. And here's right there that McBroom didn't like what Bryce Hall was doing. And he said, he's grabbing me. So then right after that is when Bryce had a point deducted because, that again, one. he would just go in, and then that you cannot do. No. Not right. MMA, guys. We got to keep it clean. Again, this main event, five rounds, two-minute rounds. Bryce Hall's already had a point deducted. That first round looked like it was clearly to Austin McBroom. Yeah, so possibly that round is a 10-8 round, right, with the point being taken. No doubt. That's what I judged it on on the unofficial scorecard. Oh. So far, it's going the way I thought with Austin with the lead, but Bryce is a tough kid. And these two are just standing there. Big right oh, hand. Right. picking up. is clearly an advantage. You know, my biggest takeaway, it looks like Austin's having fun in there. He no. is. No. He is. The speed of Austin McBroom is unreal. His footwork is amazing, and this is exactly what Bryce had to worry about coming in. This Bryce. is deep waters for a hole. Deep waters. Bryce should be thankful that hook did not land. Ooh. Every shot oh, is good. Oh, straight left. Oh. And Bryce Hall's head is just snapping back. Doesn't want a regular 
a win and he wants this knockout. He's going for the million. He's going for the million. There's so much on the line tonight for these guys and they're really pushing through this final fight. Well, Bryce Hall does have to pay the million. Oh, I mean, wow, so Bryce does it again. Again. And now the referee's like, I'm gonna take away another one. Oh, you know, these boxing commissioners, they're used to, you know, those professional high level fights. This is a no nonsense ref. Well, it's not a secret. Bryce got paid $5 million for this. Stop, stop. Let's go. Come on. So if he has to pay a million, he's still up. Oh, a big straight left hand. Got the eight count for that one. All right, they're giving him a standing eight count. I'm good. And Bryce all saying, I'm good. I'm good, I'm good. Let me fight. And that's the end of the second round. But in the, in the judge's eye, And you just see how tough this guy is. I mean, he's sitting there arguing with, with everybody. They focus, Okay, they calm. Listen, you gotta slip those hooks. He throwing hooks, so you gotta slip them. All right, but you gotta get inside and make it a foul fight now. All right, come on. You know you can do it. Paige, what did you see here in the second round? the power shots, right? Mick Broom's come in with, with tons of punches. He has way more power. and He's utilizing oh. his weight, right? He's putting his weight behind every punch. Mm -hmm. He's got more power. He's got more quickness. Fuz, what are you seeing? Man, I see Austin taking control right now, and I see Bryce losing his composure little by little. You starting to see the blood coming out of the nose of Bryce Hall as we head into round number three. So far, Bryce has a chin. He can take a punch. Now, if those ounces were different, I don't know if it would be the same story. Yeah, that's right. If those if those Ooh, gloves were smaller. Okay. Bryce starting off strong with that body shot, head shot. Austin coming back, clinched up. Oh, he is throwing from left field. Ooh, now, a problem there, right? A little mistake on McGroom's part. Just because you're tied up, you can still punch there until the ref separates you. It's still live action. It looks like Bryce has turned the gas on. I, I, you know, it's that fight or flight response, right? He realizes he's in trouble and he needs to turn it up if he wants any chance to yeah, win this he's, fight. He's reacting to what's being thrown at him right now. He's not trying to control the narrative at all at this point. McBroom, if, if he would put punches together and not keep throwing these wannabe knockout shots, he would finish it. He would get the knockout he's looking for, but you got to set it up. McBroom really looks like he's enjoying himself <laughs> thus far. Oh, he's got to be. Once you smell blood, then you just feel, feel what it feels like to be a fighter. We are more than halfway through the scheduled five rounds. You know, earlier we talked about how nobody wanted to fight Taylor Holder. Well, it is the exact opposite. 